Yo YouTube, what is going on? Welcome back to the Jeep and Daily channel. So, before we get started, this video was recorded a couple days ago. I just never made an intro and an outro to it. So, <clears throat> but what you guys are going to watch is my girlfriend who suggested this video idea to me and wanted to do this is going to rip off the flares, the fender flares on the Jeep. So, like I said, her suggestion, I'm not forcing her to do it. I didn't force her to do it. She did it purely on her own, so I hope you guys enjoy. Oh, I was going to bring gloves, but I forgot. Look, you can just... There you go. Come on, all that working out you've been doing. Okay, that one's not going to come off. It is going to come off. This one got mud all in it. Oh. Oh my god, that's a lot of mud. <laughs> I think you do that one. Do this one. Watch the metal bracket underneath of it. Yeah, please don't hurt yourself. I forgot to grab gloves from work. Oh. Look, you I have Carhartt ones in there. Gloves? Yes, that I got you. I didn't know I had gloves. Oh my god, is this mud? Is that mud? Yo. <laughs> I can't get this part. <laughs> it's stuck on the metal piece. Guess it just has to stay like this. Get out of here! <laughs> That's rusted out. Yeah, I know. Look, I'm all dirty. Okay, I'll buy ice cream. Yes! <laughs> Come on, me and Blake did this easy as sh for Rhonda. I'm out of breath. And mine's not. Alright, switch me. Can you go over here? What's this right here? What the fuck? Yeah, I don't know. It's like metal right in the middle. Don't be afraid to break anything. I'm trying. Here, let me see. It. Look at the corner. Oh, what the? Hey, it's not stuck anymore. <laughs> that dirt piece is in the nose. There, who wants to finish that one? I got you. Please watch the metal. <laughs> <laughs> you want to finish this one? Yeah, it's halfway done. <laughs> what? I can't get that one off because metal. This is metal. Two down, one to go. Go ahead, Madeline. No, I think you can help me. Helping Kyle make a video. Oh. <laughs> I was expecting it to go somewhere. It's not even. It's like. Ow, it just turned off. Well, I got to get rid of this fender lining and get rid of these metal things, but that was a fun little video to make. Probably should have did it a before and after walk around, but it's all right. 
Well, I hope that was fun to watch. Now, I'm going to point out this fender flare because this is the one that we took off at the shop. As you can see, there's no plastic left or no fender lining and no metal brackets. <clears throat> now, if we come to the other, the last three that we ripped off, there's still some metal brackets. There's still some fender attached to it. Um, I did rip out the fender lining from he on here. But real quick, let's just point out now that I'm looking at it. Hold on, let me get a flashlight. Look at all that rubber from the 1,000 subscriber burnout. Freaking awesome. As you can see, there's still metal brackets on the Jeep. This front fender still has the inner fender liner attached to it. So, I mean, I could rip that out. I don't really want to until I have a solution to patching everything. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this fun little video. I had to help a little bit. Her cousin was helping a little bit. But like I said in the intro, I did not force her to do it. She wanted to do it, so I let her do it. And also because I wanted the flares off the Jeep anyways, just to give it that little bit of extra tire poke. Sometime this week, hopefully Thursday, we are picking up some new tires for the Jeep and we're going to hopefully get them on Thursday or Friday. So stay tuned to the channel for that to see what tires we're going with. But that's gonna do it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, leave a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscriber, hit the subscribe button down below. Thank you guys again for 1,000 subscribers. I will see you next time. Peace out.